Okay, folks, this is the oldest Jensen that I own. It's probably a late 30s number 25 without the reversing mechanism. And uh, it's not in the best of shape, but like a good friend of mine, Bear, said, she ain't real pretty, but she sure can dance. Uh, I took it off the original board because, like so many solid base Jensen's, uh, they've gotten wet from running them and that, and it kind of warped a little. When I would run it, it would make all sorts of noise. So I put it on another wood base for now, and hopefully one day uh, I can try to soak this one and uh, straighten it out. Uh, this is one of the Jensen's that I really would like to restore. Uh, the original pop off valve, which is sitting on the board, which is back then they were the heads were much bigger. It sagged out, but that can be fixed. So right now I have a uh, later pop off valve in it, and I also need to paint the stack because uh, this year engine should have a brass stack that was painted black. So I'll take that aluminum reproduction and or aluminum Jensen stack and paint it one day. But uh, she does run quite well to be the ugly duck. Hope you enjoy. Crank her up one time. Not anywhere near as old as that engine is, but uh, I sure wish I ran as good as it does. She is a smooth running old engine. I hope one day to have more riveted boilers. You can uh, see the rivets. Uh, Jensen did that until, from what I understand, uh, uh, until just after, or before the, I mean just after World War II, and then they did away with the rivets and just uh, silver soldered them. Uh, this is my only riveted boiler at the moment, Jensen, which I hope to have more one day. Pop-off valves trying to pop off, original heater. Thank you for watching. Be sure to check out my other videos on YouTube.